Okay, in this episode of Fish and Fix, uh, we're doing an oil change and filter change on this uh, 2011 uh, V6 uh, Toyota Highlander. So from O'Reilly's, I just got some 520, 5 weight 20. It says here 0 weight 20, but 5 weight 20 will be just fine. And then we're putting in this K&N filter, which will be hopefully pretty nice. It was the same price as the uh, Wix, which is like O'Reilly's main brand. So that's pretty sweet. We got a K&N for basically the same price. And yeah, let's get started. So it's just the 14 millimeter on there. On the strain bolt, oh, not too tight. And there it goes. No metal shavings, looks good. O-ring looks good. Okay, now we're gonna put back in our uh, drain bolt. It's just down to a little trickle now. It's been like that for a while. And then we're gonna crack open our, uh, I guess the housing, well, no, it's not the housing, like the cover for the oil filter, because the housing is right under here. And we'll get to that right after we put this drain bolt in. Okay, so there was two O-rings. Metal one goes up against the oil pan, and the rubber one is in between the flange of the bolt and the metal washer. And not too hard, just a nice, snug fit. That's good. There's like this little cover thing with one bolt, two bolt. And that's how we're going to access the oil filter. Just grab your 10 mil. Loosen them up. They're not that tight. Two. Out comes the thing. So right there. So that's our oil filter housing right there. And we're going to need one of these little tools right here. They're a special like Toyota wrench oil filter wrench and there's like two little notches that it grabs onto just make sure it's latched on so here it comes oh and i almost forgot we're gonna need our uh drain pan so make sure you got your drain pan under it because of all that oil basically we just got our filter here and our housing and we're just gonna take it out and that's the oil filter right there. It's like a little air filter. I've only seen these on Toyotas. All right, so there's gonna be two things that we're gonna be replacing with this. Oil filter, of course, and then there's this O-ring on the housing. And basically, I've seen all kits uh, come with one. Just make sure when you get a kit, uh, it has one because uh, you'll probably wanna be replacing that. Let's pull out our filter. And then there's gonna be two O-rings. I don't know what the other one's for, but we'll find out. Okay, so the other O-ring goes on this little cap right here. And we're just gonna lightly use the vice grip, and it's just a 3 8 end right here. And that's how I get these off. And there's the O-ring. And then we'll just tighten it down. Okay, so now we'll just put that back in or put the new one in. And there's our new filter, O rings changed. And let's slap her back in. How many push ups can you do? Push-ups? Yeah, or pull-ups. Zero. How about push-ups? Zero. You like my output? Yeah, that's nice. We just had a little uh, push-up or uh, pull-up competition a minute ago. All right, so we just screwed it back in. We oiled up the O-rings. All right, so let's we'll take our tool, get it latched on in there. So it's tight. 
making sure it's all flush and stuff. Never know. Feels good. So these just slide in first. Okay, so fire it up real fast. We put in, it's about six quarts of oil. And uh, we'll fire it up, make sure it's not leaking anywhere. And that'll be the end. All right, so another thing you'll need to do is there'll be this little light on. And you'll notice up on your dash here, it'll say, oh, oil maintenance required. So to turn that off, get on to trip A with your little uh, odometer here. Trip A and then turn off your ignition so then you're going to go in here and you're going to turn it on while so you're going to hold it down while you turn on your ignition and then watch up here resetting oil maintenance light so we just added 4,000 miles to that and it also resetted our uh oil maintenance light All right, thanks for watching this video of Fishing Fix. Uh, more fishing videos to come. Uh, if you're fishing, watching people, fishing subscribers, you're probably wondering where they're at. Uh, they're coming. It's just been hard. Uh, not really. Fishing's been poor lately. So, anyway, a little car video today. Oil change. Make sure that's tight. Anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, 2012 uh, Toyota Highlander V6. Uh, oil, oil filter change.